Dane. He's Vanessa. We're joined by Whitney Zogby from the Friends of the Animal Shelter to talk about it's a run which can stress people out, but it's for such a good cause. We normally have a cute little fuzzy friend that we show, but you know, they need help while they're at the shelter. So this is going to help them do that. Exactly. This um, is our largest fundraiser of the year. We usually Boom. make about ten to fifteen thousand dollars. All right. So it's all going towards helping our furry friends, and it's actually going to be donated directly to our Wags to Wishes campaign for a new animal shelter. So nice. the new building that um, everybody is looking forward to us moving into. This is all going to be donated to that cause. All right. So let's talk a little bit about. You know, we kind of get to see like the fun part of mm -hmm. showing the animals. What are some things that goes into caring for a cat or a dog that's been misplaced or displaced that is looking for a home? Well, you obviously have to consider the food, so we get a lot of that yes. donated thing. I do love fully. to consider food. <laughs> <laughs> Heard about that earlier. <laughs> um, yeah, so all the food that we get donation wise at the shelter is really important. We want to make, make sure those animals are kept healthy while they're down there. And the most important thing that our group, um, pays for is the medical care for the animals that are down there. Many of them come in injured, um, you know, they haven't been well cared for in the past, so maybe they've never been on heartworm medication or, you know, tick and flea medication, so we make sure they're on that. We get them the medications they need if they come in sick and injured. We get them the surgery they need in many cases, too. All right, so let's talk about the location and the time of this fundraiser. Yes, so the Run Walk for the Paws is going to be April 13th, and it starts at 9 a.m., um, but we do have late registration because I know a lot of people wait to the last minute to find out how the weather is Guilty. first. <laughs> so that starts at 8 a.m. So if you have not registered yet, stop in between 8 and 8.50 to register for the 5K and it's $30. All right. And if someone can't stop in, um, where do they need to go? Well, they can also stop in the, the day before Friday, um, April 12th at the rec center for packet pickup and you can donate $30 then or on pet All right. Well, Whitney, thank you so much for coming in. Definitely consider helping out Friends of the Animal Shelter because they help our furry friends.